Okay, now you guys have been asking me about these beautiful looking widgets on my phone's home screen, which is being showcased every time I upload a video. I've been getting so many comments asking about these widgets, how to get them and so on. I had to make a video on this and show you guys in some simple steps how to install these widgets on your phone. So let's dive right in. Now there are two applications you need to install on your phone. One is KWGT Pro app and then you need this KWGT widget pack called One UI KWGT. Like this one there are many KWGT widget packs which are not standalone applications. They need KWGT application to run these widgets. So that is the prerequisite to install any of these widget packs. Now coming to the KWGT app itself, we do get a free version on which we can use some of the widget packs. But if you want some great looking widgets like this one here, you need to pay and get KWGT Pro Key and also this premium widget pack One UI KWGT. Believe me, if you are into customization, it is worth paying one time cost for these applications which can make your home screen look beautiful and informative. Anyways, now on this phone, I have already installed the KWGT application with Pro Key, and I also have installed the One UI KWGT widget pack application, which offers some beautiful looking informative widgets. So how do we add them on the home screen? Let me show you that now. First, we need to add a blank KWGT widget on the home screen. To do that, press and hold on the home screen, tap on widgets. Here, search for KWGT widget. As you can see, we have got different sizes, 1x1, 2x2, 2x4, 3x1, 3x2, 3x4, 1x1. You can add any one of them and then expand it as per your requirement. I will just add 1x1 one one here. I'll press and hold it and add it right here on the home screen. Now I can expand it to any size I want. This is the first step. Now I'll tap on this blank widget. As you can see, it opens the KWGT application itself in which we will be able to see all the KWGT widget pack applications we have installed. As you can see, I have installed a few of them here. In this video, we are focusing on One UI widget pack because this is the one which I've been using on most of my videos and you guys have been asking about the same widget pack. Now I'll tap on this. As you can see, we've got all the widgets available on this particular pack. We have got almost 80 plus widgets on this particular widget pack. Now let me select your favorite one. This is One UI 00054. This is the widget number. I'll just tap on this. What you're seeing here is KWGT application on which we are customizing this widget pack. Now I'm not going to get too deep into everything over here. Uh, you just need to know some basics to add these widgets. So let's look at that. Now at the bottom you can see we have got items, backgrounds, layer, globals, shortcuts and touch. These options will allow you to customize each and every element on this particular widget which you're seeing here. That process is actually a bit complicated but if you're into customization you can further customize this particular widget and add it on your home screen. In this video, I'm not going to explain you everything because it's going to be a very long video. Perhaps I will make another video to show you guys how deeply we can customize KWGT widgets on your phone. So moving on, what we are going to do is we are going to tap on layer over here. This will enable us to increase or decrease the size of this widget to fit into the frame of the widget which you have already applied on the home screen. As you can see, this is the widget frame which is on the home screen and this is the widget size which is inside that frame. To make it look better by fitting into the frame, you can increase the scale or decrease the scale right here. As you can see, I'll just tap on this. On the top, we have got text preview and formula editor. Just tap on formula editor. Let's increase it to 130 or 140. I'll tap on this right mark here. Now, as you can see, the widget is fitting right inside the frame. I'll just tap on save. I'll go to the home screen and here it is. We've got this gorgeous looking informative widget on the home screen. As you can see, we've got time, we've got alarm, we've got the weather information and we also have battery percentage mentioned right here. And the best part about this widget is we also get some shortcuts right here without even customizing it. If I tap on the weather information, it is going to take me to Google app which is showing me the weather information here. When I tap on battery information, it will take me to battery settings or battery usage settings on the phone. That is just amazing. Now these shortcuts can be customized on KWGT application. I will leave it to you guys to explore that option on the app. If you need a separate video on further customizing the widget, do let me know in the comment section below. Now let me tell you something more interesting about
where you can further customize this. You can increase or decrease the size. You can change the colors. You can add more shortcuts. There are lots of things you can do on this application, which we are going to see perhaps in the upcoming video. Only if you guys comment and say that you need that video. So go ahead and leave a comment. And while you do that, be sure you are a subscriber on the channel. If you aren't already, go ahead, subscribe to the channel and smash the like button for this video. That would encourage me a lot to come up with some cool content for you guys. Now, keep in mind, this widget pack is not a standalone application. It needs Pro KWGT application to make it work on your home screen. I have left links for both the applications in the description.